Okay guys, let's take a look at this 66 Ford Mustang. It's gunmetal blue with a black bumper. You don't see that every day, now do you? Nuh-uh, that's a painted bumper. And this thing here is really nice. As you look in, it's been a customized vehicle, so whoever restored it, they're customizing, and that's an automatic, not a stick shift. And as you can see from the dashboard, going over to the instrumental, it's really nice, really clean. And uh, these seats are really nice, man. So as we come back out, you see how they really blended in the color with that black. You know, everything out here on the outside has any type of black trim on it. It goes right down to the back of the, the tail lights, all the way across. We'll be right back with a part two. Okay, guys, as we look from the driver's side, we're looking in. This thing is really sweet. You can't beat this. Automatic. We bring it in. Try to get some of the instruments. Everything is in order. Everything is in order with this car. This is sweet. Hard to beat. Let's look at the information board. All right, you all, you see the price. You have the information right there. If you like it, if you think you got enough gold to spend on it, it's sitting here at Gateway Classic Cars, guys. Crete, Illinois. Give them a call. Guys, now here we go. Now, this is a Ford Maverick, man. Now, this thing is a legendary car because this is the car with a 302 that almost put the Mustang out of business. And nobody would have thought that, but these were so affordable to buy. They were cheaper than a Mustang, and you could get really great interior in it and all kinds of options yet you're not paying the Mustang price. It was that cheap, and you got a 302 in here, which made it a muscle car. Unbelievable, right? But if you ever do watch a documentary on the Ford Maverick, they'll tell you in the documentary how the car almost put the Mustang out of business. So as we look at this backside here, you can see how nice it is with dual exhaust. Guys, this car is very nice. Amazing how one car could almost up do an upheaval at Ford and getting rid of their iconic car, their halo car, the Mustang. And this thing almost did it and Ford almost let it happen. But you know what? It was nice for the Mustang had some type of competition well within the family. These things were nice. And it's sad to say that they killed off the Maverick back then. Well, they brought it back as a truck, but this was the actual car. Okay, guys, here we go to 302, four valve. And this is the one that Ford put in this Maverick and it almost killed off the Mustang. Ain't that something? As you can see, this engine bay is so clean. And this thing is real nice. Somebody took care of this thing. And this is an iconic car. And the thing about it, Ford only built them like this for so long. And man, oh man, is this a beautiful car. I mean, you can't complain about it. Ain't nothing to say but immaculate. Well kept 302 Ford valve sitting in a Ford Maverick. Right. Okay, guys, hey, for a 72 Ford Maverick with a 302 in it, with the white, red, and blue interior and exterior, and uh, you see the price on here. So if you're interested, it's sitting here at Gateway Classic Cars, Crete, Illinois. Give them a call.